What's good, y'all? It's your boy Tracy, aka Tracy Now Morgan. In today's video, I will be bringing y'all my sneaker collection, as y'all can see in the back right here. So, recently on my Instagram story, I posted a poll. It said either a sneaker collection or a story time. 60% of y'all said a sneaker collection, 40% of y'all said a story time. So, with that being said, I will be bringing y'all a sneaker collection because I'm giving y'all what y'all asked for. Because you see what I'm saying? Y'all, you know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, let's go ahead and hop into the video. So, starting off with number one, I have these checkerboard red vans that I got. Probably almost, I got these my 10th grade year, going into my 10th grade year. Uh, not too much said about these. I don't even wear them. I don't really wear vans like that, but, you know, it's just cool little shoe. That's really all I gotta say about it. Moving on to the next pair. These are, these are one of my favorite pair of vans that I ever had. These are some fire, the I don't know the name of them, they fire though. But I did, I will pop a picture up on the screen of me wearing these with that uh, shirt I had on with a fire on it. But uh, yeah, I do like these a lot. I recommend you go with your actual size. I'm going size up. I mean, a half size up. I got these in a 10 and a half, but I should have got them in a 10 because they do flop off your feet. Just letting y'all know that. Moving on to the third pair. These are some all white vans that I recently got, I think like last year. And I did mess them up. I uh, got them dirty and I put them in the washer. But the thing is, I think I put too much bleach on it and they, I don't think y'all can tell, but they had this yellow ring right here. Yeah, y'all see. They got a yellow ring around them. Yeah, it just messed the shoe up completely. I think it's just, I think it just got on. Nah, I think they got on both pair of shoes, like both pair. And I don't really wear them no more. They just sit in my closet. But yeah, that's really all I got to say. It was just an all white shoe. I just wanted to get a, another all white shoe instead of my forces. So. Yeah, that's it. Now moving on to number four. I just recently picked up, um, just to let y'all know, my sneak collection is not in a partic partic particular order. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going with the order I placed them in. But I did just recently buy these from Finish Line. These are some sevens. I don't know if they just dropped or they been out, but um, if you if you stay where I stay, you know that none of the shoe stores in the mall sell real Jordans no more. Everybody's selling them the Mexican Jordans. So it was a pleasure and an honor to actually see some real Jordans in the store. So um, not too much said about these. I will be throwing these on with a clean fit real time soon. What? Real time soon, real soon, real time, whatever. But like I was saying, yeah, I did recently just buy these. Uh, not too much said about these because I haven't put them on yet. So uh, yeah. Moving on to the next pair of shoes. These are some camo forces that I got my freshman year of high school. I only wore them about five times. I count on my hand um, because I don't really have nothing to wear with them. But I did recently wear them this year with a puffer jacket that I got at an H&M. Went real good. Uh, but yeah. Moving on to the next pair. These are some 13s that I bought myself last year around Christmas. These were on sale, I think, for like 160. I like this. I think it's an aqua blue. I'm not sure. It's like an aqua blue color. Jordan 13s, I wore these a numerous amount of times. I do like them, you know what I'm saying? Cause blue is my favorite color, but this is a different like shade, color blue, but every blue is my favorite color. So yeah, not too much said about these. I like them. Oh, I don't know what that's, crocodile, snake. I don't know what that is, but as y'all can tell, you know, it's very detailed. That's what I like about it, you know? But, that's all I gotta say. Moving on to the next pair of shoes. These are some Jordan 5. I do not know what these are called. I think I call them Golden State. You feel me? Yeah, these are cool little shoe. Once again, blue, my favorite color. If y'all ever want to give me some, just know I like blue, blue candy, blue raspberry, blue berry, all that. I like it. These are the only pair of Jordan 5s that I have in my collection so far. So I will be looking forward to getting more pairs um, by the end of summer if, the, if any more even come out. But yeah. These are a cool shoe, but that's all I got to say about these. Now, moving on to the next pair of shoes. Yes, they are the same shoe, different sizes. Now, this is a size 10, this is a size nine and a half. Now, with forces, see, me, I wear size 10 in shoes, in all shoes, but in forces, I wear nine and a half. So, with these, these are huge. They look like bricks on my feet. You see? They look like bricks on my feet. Now, with these, they fit perfectly. Now, I do have to get a new pair because these are creased and these are creased too. But inside these, I have the, the um whatever it's called, the thing that you put in for it not to crease. I do have these inside of here. I tried to put them in there, but it's not comfortable. So, I will be getting a new pair of forces very time. Very, I can't talk. Very soon. So, yeah, that's all I got to say. Moving on to the next pair. These are some Nike MTK Tenko, Tenko, if I'm not mistaken. I got these shoes last year, my 11th grade year. I got these last year. I think they were like $75. I take it back. I think, yeah, I think they were $75. Um, no doubt. That's the real, that's the real, that's the real. but 
It is a cool little shoe. I do like these. Now, these look huge on my feet. I tried wearing them with skinny jeans one time. It did not look right. But, um, yeah, it's a cool little shoe. Size 10. Not too much to say about these. Now, moving on to the next pair. These are my Comedy Garçons uh, CDG Converse. I got these off Farfetch. If you don't know what it is, that is a website who sells uh, high brand clothing, uh, sneakers, all that high brand fashion streetwear. Uh, that I recommend y'all go shop with them. This is the only thing that I purchased from their website ever. But these are, I do like these a lot. Now the thing with these, I thought, so these were women's sizes. So in women's I wear, I don't, I forgot what size I wear, but I ordered a size down. So these are actually a nine, but they fit like a 10. So when I wear them throughout the day, you see, I gotta wear uh, thin socks with them because if I wear thick socks, it's too much pressure on my, you see what I'm saying? So yeah, but I do like these a lot. I do wear them, as y'all can tell. But yeah, these one of my favorite pairs in my collection. Um, yeah. So moving on to the next pair of shoes. These are some Air Max 97s, if I'm not mistaken. I got these in Tallahassee in the mall on um, my birthday last year. These were like 190, I think. Again with the blue, you know. And I like how it's like a reflective, like it's like rainbow colors. That's real cool. That's one thing I really like about these. And it got like the gold shoelaces right there. If it focus, you got the gold shoelaces. Not the gold shoelaces, but the gold shoelace tip, if, if that's what it's called. And with 97s, if you have a pair, you can actually take this off if you don't want it on there. But I just realized that. Like I just found out that you could do that. But now I'll keep mine on because, <laughs> why would I do that? Moving on to the next pair of shoes. These are some Air Force Ones that I got in Miami. Not uh like four or five years ago. I can't remember what they're called, but if I do find a picture of them, I will pop them up on the screen like right here. Uh but these are a size nine, which is too small for me, but I can still wear them, but it's just a lot of pressure on my on my toes. So I will be keeping these because these look like they'll go for a lot of money on GOAT or StockX or something. But yes, these shoes are Fabuloso. So and these are my babies right here. Had these are probably the shoes that I had the longest in my collection, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, they still in good condition. You know, I just gotta wipe them down a little dusty since they haven't been sitting in my collection for over four years. But yes, I do like these a lot. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know what y'all think about these down in the comments. Now moving on to the next pair. These are some Nike Air Max 720s, if I'm not mistaken. This is the color. I also got these last year, my 11th grade year. Um, out of City Gear, if you don't know what that is, you stay in Pensacola, it's the store right over there uh, where City Trends used to be. Now these, I do like these a lot. These were 130 when I first bought them. I don't know how much they are now. They're probably higher or cheaper because I don't even think they sell this colorway anymore. But yes, I do like these a lot. The purple, the different shades of purple and pink goes well. These are also a size 10. I got these women's sizes. I got the right size in these. I like the Comedy Garçons, but that's really all I gotta say about these. Moving on to the next pair. Now these, I also got my freshman year. My mom bought me these out of City Gear, the same store I got those 720s from. I do like these a lot. You know, I have taken good care of these. Uh, bottom not too dirty. The other pair, it came with yellow and black shoestrings. The other pair, I got the black shoestrings in because just mismatch just to be different. Yes, they do have creases in them because Jordan 1's crease very easily. But I'm not really a mid type of guy like the hot tops because it just it just makes everything look better. But that's really all I gotta say about these. Moving on to the next pair. Now these are some Nike Cortez. These are what they are. Um, I just recently bought these not too long ago. These are a size 10 and a half. Now these, I cannot lie, I should've got like an 11 because these do fit a little snug, you no know, cap. So if y'all are looking forward to getting these, I recommend y'all go a size up. Or oh, that's just probably my how my feet are. But yeah, I do like these a lot. The red and blue, all white, you know what I'm saying? It's just like something different from, you know, all white shoe. So, you know, I recommend y'all go get these. These were 75, if I'm not mistaken. Um, It's a little simple cop. So that's really all I gotta say about them. Moving on to my next pair now. These are some Nike Air Max 95s. I bought these my freshman year, if I'm not mistaken. These were my second pair of shoes that I ever bought for myself. Uh, the first pair I bought were some wool Jordan 1's mids. I will pop a picture right there. I liked them when I first bought them, but I worn them out because the bottom was like red and blue. Red sparkles on the shoelaces. I really like. Um, I really like the bottom. That's really why I got them. Once again, it's just an all-white shoe. Other than some plain forces, you can go with whatever all-white shoe you like. Moving on to the next pair. Now, these are some Jordan 1's. 
These are the Mocha ones. I wore these about three, four times to school. I haven't bought the outfit. I haven't bought the shirt that I wanted to wear with these yet because I've been tripping. But yeah, not too much said about these. Moving on to the next shoe. These are some New Balances. I can't remember the name of these. If I do find a name, I will pop it up on the screen. These are one of my favorites in my collection. I like how it fades into the, uh, to the red, black to red. It's really nice. If I'm not mistaken, I think these were like $70. Same price as other uh, bands. So y'all go cop y'all some. Moving on to the next pair. These are some Jordan 2 Lowe's. I got these out of the Nike outlet uh, about three, four years ago. I think I was still in high school when I got them. Um, not too much said by these. Once again, an all white shoe. Can't go wrong with it. Ten and a half. Uh, I don't even wear these no more, but you know, it's just some chill that I can throw on. I can wear what I got on, to be real. I got a red Nike shorts on with the white, white tee. Just a cool outfit. If I was going somewhere, I'll wear that. Moving on to the next pair. These are some Jordan 13 Wheats. I got these my freshman year. The end of the freshman year, actually, if I'm not mistaken. Um, 190, so it came out to be 204 because it's $14 at the tax. I do like them, but I don't wear them no more because they are 10 and a half, which is like, they look like dinosaur feet. Like when I look down, they look, they look huge. So I really don't wear them. And if you know me, all my jeans are skinny. So yeah. Moving on to the last pair of shoes in my collection. It would have to be these Jordan 13s that came out in January, if I'm not mistaken. January or either the beginning of February. No, they came out in January. Uh, I bought these. They were 204 once again. Um, yeah, not too much to say about these. I just wanted to add some new color into my collection because I don't really have shoes with uh, orange in them except for those MT M M2K Tinkos. Cool little shoe. Wear it. White tee. Skinnish. But yeah. That's my shoe collection. But, uh, yeah, I'm hot. Like, my room is hot. But, yeah, that's my shoe collection. Them shoes right there. Um, I will be copying way more shoes than what you are currently seeing right now oh i got now you see these are my superman shoes i got these at a walmart i think my freshman year too i got them for my birthday and then those are my crocs uh i don't even wear crocs like to be real i just went to work and i throw some on with it and these are my slides i don't think it's really even counting shoes but it's whatever and then these are my adidas shoes adidas slides as well so those are all my shoes in my collection Hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you drop a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, share the video, turn on post notifications. It's your boy Tracy, and I'm out you.